uh, I had dinner with 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 uh, family and with my 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 friends. Did you watch any of the tape back last night? Uh, <laughs> you you came later because I, I I said the first in the press conference. I I don't finish my my analysis. The look watching the match in the yesterday because I. I started this morning, but uh, I am going to, to continue it after this press conference. You, you, you make substitutions quite early and they seem to have, they have, they have an effect. I mean, you've got a lot of points through those substitutions. Why do you think that is? What's been, what, why do you think that's had such a positive effect? Is it other team fitter? Suelen hacer los cambios muy pronto y han tenido buenos resultados y habéis sacado puntos a consecuencia. ¿Por qué crees que es eso? Es lucky. A otros matches es lucky. And because you, I, I learned in Spain with one coaches Javi Rueta. He trained in 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 Deportivo La Coruña with a very big car like a coach. And he said one one day. And he he was my coach in in San Sebastian in Real Sociedad, and he said when he said uh, to us when when I change is because I want some change maybe it's positive maybe negative but change, and it's the first uh, first idea I, I I receive and and I I, I do in my in my mind, and uh, the second is for example uh, in the another. Teams, uh, I, I had the coach. Uh, some criticisms about me is uh, I change usually very later. And here, uh, for example, that uh, you are saying to me, I, I change usually uh, uh, quickly. It's, it's, uh, it depends the, the moment, and it depends also like yesterday uh, who is how is doing uh, going the, the match. But uh, one situation we are living here is in the first half we couldn't uh, finish uh, winning uh, in the 40 matches in, in in the Premier League the first matches and maybe it's, it's one reason I need to change. You know, um, Pierre Emerick Aubameyang became the first player to 10 league goals yesterday. No one scored more league goals than him since he came to the club. Do you feel that you have got the best goal scorer in the Premier League at the moment? Es el primer Obama y en verdad 10 goles en la Premier esta temporada. Tiene más goles que cualquier otro jugador desde que llegó a la Premier. ¿Tú crees que tienes el mejor delantero de la Premier? It's the same spirit uh, to him, like a, like me and like another player. I, I want uh, he continue improving and uh, his. Uh, his uh, challenge uh, also is collective and individual and I want his challenge for him the possibility can be the best uh, scorer in, in, in this Premier and we want to help him uh, to achieve this but uh, it's because if he is scoring he is helping us He's done that um, playing a lot of the time on the left and not playing as many minutes as some other players. How impressed have you been with how much you've been able to score in, in the time and how clinical and efficient you've been? I want his best performance and uh, also uh, for the collectivity. And in his career, he played uh, winger right, he played uh, on the left, he played like a, like a striker, he played with two strikers. And I use with him here every position for, for us. And uh, sometimes also his best performance is uh, starting the match in the bench and then uh, uh, playing 20-25 playing, uh, minutes. And now, the last two matches, he's be with a very big performance and with uh, scoring, with working. And uh, I, want, I want to say to him uh, and, and, and also for, for everybody, uh, don't stop. Continuing in the, his, with his his uh, commitment every match, uh, working like like yesterday, like like Bournemouth, and I think it's also important for him. He's taking confidence with with uh, matches like like yesterday, but not only for a score. Also, 
because uh, he uh, he's helping with uh, with the pressing against Dan with with uh, with also uh, doing the duels with with the head against Dan and uh, and now also I think is is the moment uh, to say to him don't stop. You know, I mean, there's talk of Arsenal being charged with failing to control their players, but in a way, were you happy, were you proud of the way the players were all fighting together yesterday and sticking up for each other? Did that give you a bit of pride? Se dice que el club puede recibir una multa por lo que pasó tras el gol de Díaz, pero tú estás orgulloso de la unidad que demostró el plantel en ese momento. We speak a lot with the respect. The respect between us, between also another team, between also uh, in the stadium with the supporter, and and then uh, we we are speaking. We need to be together, attacking moment, defensive moment. We together after the matches. We need together with strong spirit, collective, and feel together our way. Uno, can I, you also never won at Old Trafford in the in the Premier League for. Quite a long time. Do you sense, given how you're playing and how Manchester United are playing, that this is your the club's best opportunity for ten years to to, to win at United? El Arsenal no ha ganado en Old Trafford desde hace muchos años. Visto el momento del Arsenal y el del United, que es que esta es la mejor oportunidad que tenéis para hacerlo. Each match is a big opportunity for us against every team. It's very difficult to win there. It's not now, it's in the past and in the future because uh, they are a very big team, very big player, and they have a very big atmosphere pushing, uh, helping them. And it's a very big challenge for us. And also, uh, if we can confirm our, our, our good moment or our reality moment is we need more but uh, for me also is uh, is a very very exciting match uh, my motivation preparing this match is very very big and uh, i am looking forward to to play there and final question thank you Nick. Final. Thank you. And, you know, on saturday jose Mourinho was talking about his team and he said they don't have enough mad dogs um, by which he meant players who were aggressive and could take control of the ball <laughs> But do you think that's something that your team does have? Eh, el sábado, José Mourinho ha dicho que al, al United le faltan perros locos, o sea, jodas agresivos que pueden luchar para dominar el balón. ¿Tú crees que el Arsenal sí tiene esta categoría de jugadores? It depends is much. Uh, uh, we need uh, we need player with a, a good spirit collective, individual. We need player with the the good skill uh, to keep the ball with the passes we need also when uh, we lost the ball the possibility to to recover very quickly with uh, good pressing with very good contact with very good duel against them uh, the, f the football in 90 minutes uh, usually you need a lot of things individual collectively and above all the the very good players and they have very good players Okay, guys, thanks very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.